Today we are going to discuss about how to rename a database in MS SQL. In the previous video we have seen how to create a database using MS SQL that was in part 1. Now here we consider how to rename a database. For that first of all open your management studio. This is my management studio you can see. Now I am going to rename the database name second database. For that we have two options by using Management Studio and second is through code. When using the Management Studio, you need to right click on the second database icon and select Rename. Assign a new name, third database. Press enter. This will rename your database with a new name. Now let's consider how to rename using code. Let's open one new query window. So you can see, I have opened one new query window and execute one command. Alt up database, current database name, and modify with name attribute with new database. Here we will rename the database name third database with another name. So executing this command, in the place of current database, we are placing third database. Let's assign a new name here, database. Third. So we are renaming the database name third database with another name database third. Let's execute this command. The database name third database has been set. So in order to see the results, we need to refresh the databases. If you refresh, you can see the database name third database is renamed with a new name database third. Now there is another way for renaming the database using code by using one SP stored procedure named SP rename DB. Let's see the input parameters for this SP. They are the current database and the new database name. These are the two input parameters for this stored procedure. So let's place the current database name that is database third we are going to rename the database name database third with another name database third we are reversing back to the old name that is third database now if we execute this query this stored procedure we can see this is successfully executed as you can see in order to see the results, you need to refresh the database icon. If you refresh the database icon, you can see the database third is replaced with third database. Here you can see the new name is third database. So, by this way, we can rename a database using code. Thank you guys for watching this video. Please visit technomark.in for more information.